Every week, we scour the internet to find the most amazing, creative, and jaw-dropping content developed in Unity. This is Game Dev HQ, and enjoy the best of made with Unity. Revisited the rainy surface shader scene by Harry. Being able to work in real time thanks to Eevee helps to get an idea for the final look that we want to achieve in Unity by Cedric. As you brave the crumbling rock bridge, you are blessed with some breathtaking views by Volumetric Games. Let's explore these beach cliffs by Hyper Mega Pixels. Here are some fragments. Wheel of Persona. Localized entry within a unity scene by Harry. Have a relaxing weekend by Robot Nights Online. The AI has been training hard by Alberto. Here's a sneak peek of a combat mechanic by Roman. Field by Sam Violin. Some of the wild machines found on Mars by Big Rook Games. More experiments with responsive UI and hand tracking by Denny's.
just another rough autumn night by Sons of Valhalla. Continue testing axes. Looks like some have issues by Sergi. Games out by Damien. Link is below. He was accused of some sort of crime, wrongfully, and they locked him away. And then he broke out, and that's the gist of it. But there's more to the story than that. There were dungeons, ever changing, and monsters. Thankfully, he was a good fencer, and he knew his way around magic too. Speaking of magic, magical loot he sold me. Good pieces, decent condition. Some of which he made himself. Crafty sort he was. Secrets he uncovered. Traps and obstacles he had to overcome. He was a determined sort. Whenever I thought he was dead, he came back stronger. But, you know, I'm not sure whether he survived in the end. Whether he escaped from Slash's Keep. Rony Fracture Test 0.5 by Six Thorns. Every day I'm polishing my pebs. Working on some title screen stuff today by Andrew. Improving level design by a beginner's dev blog. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe to be notified about upcoming videos and use the Twitter hashtag MadeWithUnity to possibly be featured on our upcoming videos. This is GameDevHQ.com and we're out of here. See you next week.